All hail Biafra. All hail the land of the rising sun. Good morning, good afternoon to you wherever you are in the world, Biafra family. May Chukwe Kikabiyama bless us all. May he bless our evil leader, Mazen Namde Kano. He say, he say, he say. So my people, I want to use this opportunity to correct something because a lot of people have been asking us, must we all be on social media? Must we all be on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube making video concerning Biafra? We should let our Ebu leader, Mazen Namde Kano, finish what he started. I want to ask you a question. All of you saying those things. You expect freedom to come to you. You expect freedom to run come meet you. You don't know that you will fight for it. Or if someone that is fighting for your freedom, you don't know that you will support that person. As Mazen Namde Kano is doing for us. You don't expect us. You don't want us to support him. You expect freedom to run, come meet you. You expect freedom to come and meet you in your parlor. All of you will sit down, cross your leg, fold your hands and say, if Biafra comes, all of us are Biafra. Someone is fighting for your freedom. How else do you show support? How else do you show that you are solidly behind him? How else do you show appreciation? If not, then to come out, tell the world, we really love what this man is doing for us. We are solidly in support of what he's doing. You want us all to go sit down like you people that doesn't know where you belong. You don't want us to come out and express ourselves. You don't want us to come out and show the whole world that we are happy with what he is doing for us. That we are happy for him coming out to fight for our freedom. You want us to go inside and sit down, cross legs. You really know as you claim. You won't be discouraging people. Those that allowed you people to discourage them. We should leave the struggle for our Ebuli Damazan Namde Kano to finish what he started. Really? We have a lot of betrayers, a lot of saboteurs. Isn't everybody that came out and started shouting Biafra, Biafra, Biafra really in support of Biafra? All of them based on uh, even once Biafra come, we are all Biafra. If they didn't come, we are still Nigerians. Biafra will come if you don't know. We are going home. And nothing can stop that. We are being killed every day. They are killing us in Anambra. They are killing us in North. They are killing us in every part of Nigeria, the so called Nigeria Zoo. You want us to keep quiet. You don't want us to talk. You don't want us to speak up. Go hang yourself. Or better still, Go hang Strafana or a lot of people are coming out every day, but YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, every day to support this struggle. You'll be in your pal across your leg, fold your hands, and expect us to do the same. If we don't come out to talk, if we don't come out to speak, how else do you expect us to show appreciation? How else do you do you want us to show that we are in support of this struggle? How else do you want us to support this struggle if we don't come out to speak up? It's not by running to a post and comment to comment. When our elderly ones started doing live video on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, all we did was to support them. But at the end of the day, some of them fell off on the road. We have to start where they stopped. If you know, and it's not a lot of people know that we are fighting for freedom, but they don't know how we're being treated. They don't know how we're being killed. We should stop telling you people what you already know. What they do you are killing know? us every day. You don't want us to speak up. They are killing us in every part of the zoo. You don't want us to speak up. You don't want us to support our Ebuli demands and Namde Kano. Our mothers will suffer. Fam and Fulani headsmen will go there, destroy it with their cows. You don't want us to speak up. They are killing our people in Enugu, uh, Anambra. You don't want us to speak up. They are killing our people in Nemo State. You don't want us to speak up. They are killing us in every part of the zoo. You don't want us to speak up. You people should continue deceiving yourselves. You claim you know what you're fighting for. You claim you're a beer friend. But you can't speak up. 
If you think I don't know what I'm saying or you think I don't know what I'm doing, you that knows what is going on, you that know what you're doing should come out and speak. You that knows how, how we've been treated, you should come out and speak up. Don't sit in your place and think you can discourage people. If you really know as you claim those things, you should come out and speak it up. Yeah, people can only deceive those that allowed you to deceive them. I'm not just a Biafran. I came the same place with our Ebul Demaz and Namde Kano. We want freedom and freedom we will get. You saboteurs and betrayers that confused people cannot deceive us. It's only those that doesn't know what they're fighting for. You people now think we're coming out to speak up is a business. Biafra struggle did not start today. We backed up. We stopped. We, st we didn't come out to make videos because our elderly ones were in charge. All we did was to support them before some of them fell out. Before some of them turned out to be betrayers and saboteurs. Coming out to speak, coming out to tell those that don't really understand, coming out to clarify people, you think it's a business. It's business to those that don't know what they're fighting for. Stop deceiving yourself by calling yourself a beer friend. You're a hardcore beer friend, but you are not in support of what your fellow beer friends are doing. If we come out to support Mazen Namdekan, we are praising him. If we don't come out, it's the same you all frustrated people that will say, look at them, someone came out to fight for their freedom, but they can't show appreciation. They can't show support. We are supporting him now. All of them are still saying, frustrated people are still saying, we should leave him to finish what he started. Why are you people this bitter? Are we the one frustrating you all? You people can only deceive those that don't know what they're fighting for. For me, I really know what I'm fighting for. I want freedom. And that is what we will get. If you don't like what you are doing, if you don't like the way we are coming out to support this struggle, if you don't like the way we are coming out to speak up, then continue sitting in your house. Stop coming to our page and our channel to drop your frustrated comment. I'm not bothered about your comment. That's why we love and respect our Ebu leader, Mazen Namde Kanu. He don't have time to respond to foolish and frustrated betrayer, saboteurs like you all. We are here to do that. We are here to reply all of you. We are here to put you all where you all belong to. Frustrated people trying to frustrate others. Betrayers and saboteurs. Haters of freedom. All of you saying nonsense don't like freedom. You don't want to be free. You want to continue being in one Nigeria so that they will continue killing our people. Being in one Nigeria, we're not begging you to come join Biafra. We know ourselves. We know the real Biafrans and those that don't belong to Biafra. It's not those that one leg will be in Nigeria, one leg will be in Biafra. They don't know where they belong. Frustrated people. Confused set of people. Biafra is here. We are all going home and nothing can change that. Thank you all. May Chukwu Kikabi and bless our Ebu leader, Mazen Namdekan, and bless us all. Biafra, one family, one family, Biafra. Biafra is a very big one family that no one can divide again. No one can divide this family again. We are together now and nothing can stop that. Thank you, my people. May Chukwu Kikabi and bless